Good morning, friends. And just like that, it's Vlogmas day three. another really good night's sleep which is wonderful it is 4 17 i just threw a load of laundry in the machine i'm gonna make i think a cup of chai my throat's feeling a little a little gross today so going to get that going might light some candles let's do that i have had a lot of these electric candle lighters, but this is by far the best one. I've lit my amber candle. I'm gonna go over here and light this one too. Why not? This live pine is getting pretty dried out. It's going to need Replaced. I haven't really checked on Maybe because it's hanging I will have... Yeah, this actually doesn't look that bad This is all live garland except for obviously those sparkly picks but like it honestly looks okay. I Mean it's dry as a bone but <laughs> Stephen <laughs> must have been cleaning something yesterday. He left that there. It's time for my very complicated chai tea recipe. I set my smeg on the latte setting. I get my chai super latte. I have to order a pack soon. I get I hit my latte setting, I get one scoop of my chai, and then I just, I sprinkle it in a little bit at a time, because I started with cold water. All right, and that is my fancy chai latte recipe. Already this morning, I've drunk an entire bottle of water. This is my Gatorade limited edition Serena Williams water bottle. <clears throat> I still have this mug. I think this was from Vlogmas year one, or maybe year two. It's from Anthropology. I don't even know if they still make it anymore, but it is one of my favorites. Let's pour all that in there. And now I'm gonna to top it with the clever latte dust. I don't know what's really in here, Coconut sugar, Himalayan pink sea salt, rice bran, vanilla, cinnamon. It does have like a little bit of like a peppery taste to it, which I really enjoy. Just catching up on Vlogmas's. What's crazy is when you're doing Vlogmas, it is so hard to catch up on other people's. So I typically end up watching them in January, but ones that I'm kind of digging, I'm watching Alexandra Rodriguez, of course, Christina. I mean, it wouldn't be Christmas without her. She actually just mentioned me in day two. She bought the book that I'm currently reading. I just adore her. She's just so kind. I'm watching Remy. I definitely want to go to Zoe Sug. I mean, it's been one of the best vlogmases ever. Um, is there anyone else? Oh, and Samantha Joe. She makes me feel young again. She makes me laugh. I just find her funny. Um, so those are kind of the ones that I'm trying to catch up with. I am going to get a workout in. My narwhal is getting ready to clean and <clears throat> because I did all 
my main floors yesterday and they look like they're so I am stunned because I didn't know if it would clean as well as it does it is just as good as me mopping them while I work out I am going to have it do my mud room my laundry room doesn't need done I'm gonna have it do the peloton room and the powder room just so they're all done mopped and cleaned but yeah this part of the house looks great. <laughs> so I'm getting my water. Check that out. So I had designated this room. So after this room, it went ahead and cleaned the mops. And now it's going to set itself up in the powder room. It will like scan it. And now it'll start vacuuming and mopping the powder room. It has been two weeks since my knee injury. I'm feeling better. I am just going to ride my bike very easily today. I'm gonna do the midnight's ride, because I haven't had a chance, because it released right about when I hurt my knee. So I am going to do that ride today. I'm gonna to take it easy. I might not even like follow the instructor. I'm just gonna enjoy the process. And hopefully like the movement helps a little bit, but I am not ready to run on the treadmill or anything. But I'm bummed because of course my knee went out right as I started training for the Pittsburgh Half Marathon in May. My face look, that mask, I did the um, youth to the people mask. It's made me really, red it was an overnight mask so hopefully the redness goes down i just washed it off um when i woke up so maybe that's why i'm a little bit more red but like my chin is really like i'm just really red but um yeah i'm training for the half marathon in pittsburgh and kind of bummed that my knee went out just as i was getting into my groove but we have plenty of time and we'll get back there so i'm gonna hop on the bike do 30 minutes easy at my own pace and then I have to go to work today. Such is life. I am ready for work. And just as I'm getting ready to leave, the whole world is waking up. Good morning. Well, I'm going to work. I'm holding a lamp. We both win. This is why we need to, oh, she stayed, oh. In, she stayed in her boundaries. <laughs> Who needs a fence? You can't fence a Mabel in. But you have to. I, I oh, when I was up last night, I uh, reached out to two more companies for quotes. Oh, okay. Online. All right, friends, I have to head off to work. I should only be gone until like one and then back, so. I will see you all in a little bit. All right, friends, I am back from work. It's about two o'clock. I had a really good time. I'm, I was kind of like, not irritated, but like, ugh, to have to work on a Saturday, but actually it was really great. I threw on one of the Hander, Hannah Anderson um, pajama shirts and a puffer vest, and it's so festive and cool. That's why I love them, because you can get the dual purpose out of them. But I have a nail appointment. I'm gonna go take care of that, and then we'll catch up. It is so windy outside, but I am back. I've like put on some comfortable clothes. Um, let me show you my manicure. Stephanie and I wanted something festive, but not like overly Christmas. I haven't had my nails done in like a month. This just came in the mail. It's our new cookie jar. It's from Pottery Barn. It's so cute. It's actually like a really nice, hold on, let me see if I can. It's a really nice size. And I just think it's so adorable. I'll have that linked below. And then the other thing that came is my new Stanley cup. So I got on the Stanley train before it blew up. I have the cream one, but the cream one shows a lot of dirt. And I've noticed even now when I'm washing it, it's not necessarily getting clean. So I just, Wash this one out. This color is called, oh, oh my gosh, I'm not gonna remember now. It's not Dune. 
It's gonna drive me crazy, but I will link it because it's back in stock. But I wanna say, my sister and I were on the Stanley train prior. My dad worked in the coal mines and only ever had like Stanley thermoses and lunch boxes. So my sister and I have been like very, like familiar with the brand for quite some time. So it's really funny to see it blow up in the way it has. Oh my gosh. The other thing I realized I haven't even had time to do yet today is look at the advent calendar. Pick up litter yesterday was a breeze. I actually did it multiple times while I was running in and out of meetings and things. Do something for an animal. I do something for animals every day, but I might have to move this to this day because I actually knew that my week was going to be crazy and I'm traveling next week. So Steven already donated all the bags. I filled up like five huge garbage bags of clothes. So I should still be pretty caught up. I might have to do this tomorrow just because it is so windy and like limbs are falling out of trees and it's rainy. Light a candle and listen to your favorite music tomorrow. That will be a breeze. All right, I will get caught back up on all the things. Steven is taking a nap. Doggies are upstairs with him. I think I'm just going to just take a minute to pause because I led a training today. I did a hiring fair. I rushed home, I ate lunch, ran to my appointment, and now I can have a second to breathe. It's been like a little bit of a crazy Saturday. So I think I'm going to light my 20 minute candle and just chill. <laughs> It is five o'clock and I just woke up. I dozed off. It has been such a weird, busy day. My hair's all wackadoodle. We are all just hanging out now. I woke up, but I don't feel bad because Steven napped for quite some time today too. I did have my famous lunch, which a lot of you commented on. I should really show them that tomorrow when I make it. Oh. Yes, I'm sure they are just like it's sort of like a taco. So I think I people have lost their sleep Also, you do realize that no one thinks you should eat up lunch meat essentially. No, some people I, I read the comments very some few said that I should very few Well, they're missing out because a warm plate is better than a cold plate Although these two could care less I forgot to take out uh, Bubba's dog food last night, so he had to have Mabel's. Did you share? Yes, but then I defrosted it and she had his for dinner, so. So we're all square away? We're all squared away, yeah. We're all squid away? All right, let's go open some advent calendars. I'm sorry I fell asleep, everyone. It definitely was just like one of those days after I took a minute to like, chill out it just is just caught up with me all right let's open some advent calendars and see what we get today also my throat is still feeling funny i know i told you guys this morning it just feels like a little scratchy all right day three i have no contacts in and no glasses so this should be fun I wonder if you see it yet. <laughs> Wait, where in the world? Oh, there it is. It is Skylar Clean Beauty, Pink Canyon, Green Fruit, Pink Salt, and Cedar. Oh, it's a perfume. It's a roller ball. I really like it. It's super fresh and clean. I really, really like it. All right, let's go. Let's do Mary Mary while we're here. Mary, Mary. All right. Day three. This has to be... Okay. This is more tracks today. So let's see. Okay, so this then... Okay, I am so perplexed. Okay. 
But then, wait. If that goes there, there's no way that... I'm so confused. If I have to make a figure eight, the X would have to go here. So like that would go there. Maybe it's, that's not the right way. Okay, that's the right way, but it wouldn't fit that way. Okay, maybe I have to fixate on not making it perfect. And I think that is how we should be right now. All right, I think that's it. All right, day three. We're gonna have to move, we're gonna have to find a new spot for this too. Day three, I can't believe it's day three. I was watching Christina Brawley and she was just saying like, I can't believe we're like settling in. It's day three, we're rocking and rolling. I clearly don't have my glasses on because I'm struggling to see today. A thermal cleansing balm. I actually just have started using an oil-based cleanser and I've really, really liked it. So pumped about that. Okay, let's go diptyque now. It's the Pisces box. Fig. This is a good one. Oh, that is so, such a good scent. All right, that can go away. Boom. All right. Where, I had advent calendars here last year, but I think I had them better spread out. I need to reconfigure as we get into vlogmas and as this scene grows i need to figure that out tomorrow pour some sugar on me i love that this one is just gonna be nice and easy and in order it is a gummies this is such an underrated calendar it's so good and they are the holiday presents. Hello, Dolly. Well, hello, Dolly. It's so nice to have you back where you belong. You're looking swell, Dolly. And I can tell, Dolly. Day three. These are really hard to find today because I don't have my glasses or contacts in. I still beat you. Mm. You lost. Ah, uh, they're like the peppermint sticks. Someone told me if I don't love these like to eat, like to put them in hot cocoa or like coffee or tea, that's a great idea. I'm, she's doing better this year. Yeah, she must have been working. So she last must have been working. I mean, I think it might have been how I stored it last year. Stored I don't know. It. Someone said it was because I stored it vertically, but I feel like you should be able to. Because like half of the boxes were empty. I think there was a oh. box that was just missing stuff. But it's clear that Dully's been working nine to five to make this year's advent calendar slightly better. Well, I mean, she paired with William Sonoma, which you wouldn't expect from Dolly Parton, but. You know. She has a whole like cookie line there. At William Sonoma? Yes. I thought she was like country and you know. She is country. William Sonoma is country. William Sonoma is not country. It's. I thought she was like hard scrabble and you know up from the bootstraps and William Sonoma is not that <laughs> place. That would be like. Okay, you know what? Dolly is an icon. She is. And she doesn't need your judgment I'm around not, what brand not, deals she takes. I'm just saying. Where's your William Sonoma deal? I have a William Sonoma deal. Exactly. <laughs> have you written hundreds of songs? I have not. I'm not taking. Also, away from do her, you know her saying, song Two Doors Down? Two Doors Down. They're laughing and drinking no, and but, having a. No, wait. So she was talking about that song on an interview. Guess what it's about? 
A so, gay no, when <laughs> she, okay. when she was on tour, there was this hotel that they loved to stay at that was also a restaurant, uh -huh. and she loved their fried clams. But you don't, you don't eat clams. I know, but. She was put on a liquid diet to lose weight, so she wasn't allowed to eat food. And two doors down, all of her bandmates and people on the tour with her were like enjoying the fried clams. And like that, she started writing the song that night about them being two doors down, they're laughing and drinking and having a party. But now it's actually a song about her being on a liquid diet and they're eating the fried clams that she wished she could have been eating. That's unfortunate. But it also just shows like she write, could write a song about anything. That's true. Um, I saw your calendar, uh, or your two calendars. Wait, also can you tell them that I have certainly done the clean out the closet and donate clothes? Yeah, but not today. Yes, but I've, I, I got ahead yes. of it already. No, we, we went, I, you had four leaf bags full of clothes. Some of them were Bubby's clothes. No, they were all your clothes. From his younger days. From his days as a backup it dancer. Was, it was ridiculous. I was embarrassed. It, I, but some of those I've had for years, it was just time to get rid of them. Mm. Anyway, uh, I did something today uh, for animals. What'd you do? I walked them. I know, but I'm gonna make some bird feeders tomorrow for us. We have to get our bird feeders going for winter, but I think I'm gonna do those grapefruit ones again. We've opened Advent Keller's. Steven is being a gem and making dinner, and he is gonna be on his own for dinner most of next week because, I yeah, I leave Monday for Philly. Okay. Tuesday I'm in Camden. I'm home on Wednesday. I fly to Newark on Thursday. You have to go back to Jersey? Yes. Back on Friday. Oh. So should I make dinner on Friday? I don't know. We'll or, figure out life. Or is it going to be like a late flight? Mabel's going to come pick me up. She just got her license. Okay. Uh, good luck with that. She, she barks and um, she's almost caused a couple accidents in the car. And Steven, once again, this is the second piece of decor you've commented on this vlogmas. Yes, I like it. He was like, I really like that gingerbread house cookie jar. So well, if Steven likes it, it's a go, and you should go pick one up immediately. Yeah. It is linked below. No, you don't have to pick it up immediately. We had a um, gingerbread house that Bob was eight once. Do they know the story of that? No, because I didn't even have a channel back in those days. Uh -huh. So we made gingerbread houses with my nieces when we lived in Charlotte, North Carolina. And we set them outside to dry because down there it was warm. Uh, and On the railing of our deck. And we let him go outside not thinking that he would bother them. And he ate like four gingerbread houses. It was a massacre. Yeah. We call it the Great Gingerbread Massacre of 2008. It was either 2008 or 2009. I just keep bringing the camera back to you because you're so cute. Ow, we should do your advent calendars. All right. You take Bubba's. He already knows what it is. Bobby. Mabes, look. And yes, hers does play music. Where's day three? <gasps> Here it is. Merry Christmas! Happy New Year! I wish I would have just captured that on film because someone is getting the zoomies. Someone's getting the zoomies. Someone's getting the zoomies. Someone's getting the zoomies. Someone's getting the zoomies. Hey! Ouch! Ow! Hey! Grandma and Grandpa are not going to tolerate this. 
Who's the zoomies? Who's the zoomies? Hey, don't get comfortable. Why? We have to go open the tea calendar. All right, take us around the world, Stephen. All right, so what is where it? are we going today? Maybe. Nepal. Hmm. Mountainous. Um, organic Nepal black tea. Let's see. Do you like black tea? Eh. Oh, I like the smell of that. Okay. We need something witty. We don't have anything fun to say today about the tea calendar. I mean, it's black tea. That's it. So. Does tea come from China? What famous housewife said that line? Wait, let me give the context. It was like, Which does Ramona cause drama? And the housewife said, does tea come from China? Uh, no. Um. I'm not a trophy wife. Sonia. Yes. Sonia, Sonia. Sonia said it. Sonia said, oh, we could have named her Sonia. Oh, God, no. She's a Mabel. All right, friends. I know today was a little bit low key, but. Steven singing Taylor Swift in the living room. I don't know if you could hear it. He was singing. It's <laughs> Those are sort of the lyrics, but not quite. He's trying to sing anti-hero. But I know today's vlogmas wasn't super exciting, but also I had to work today and there's just a lot of things happening. However, we got some good footage and I promise to make up for it tomorrow and in the coming days. Um, some days are just like this, but I'm gonna end it like I end all of them. Actually, I haven't ended any of them yet, but I'm gonna actually end it correctly so everyone knows if you're new what it should sound like. Take care of yourself, take care of others. Now you had me so confused that I can't remember it. Take care of yourself, take care of others, be kind. Kindness is free, give it to everyone. Until next time, which will be tomorrow, Bye bye